to learn about inherited and acquired traits. We've already done quite a bit with inherited traits, so we're mostly learning what acquired traits are. So as you can see in this picture, we've got some giraffes that look very similar because they inherited most of those traits from their parents. Sorry about that. What are traits? Traits are observable features of an animal or plant. These features can be used to describe a plant or animal. These features can help an animal survive, grow, and reproduce. Inherited traits, these are the traits we've been learning about. These are the traits that are passed from adult plants or animals to their offspring, child, baby, tiny plant. Offspring can inherit traits from both parents. For example, our hair color, we've learned several of these before. Here's one, the tongue on a giraffe, just like the tongue abilities that we have uh, that we've talked about already. The color of a flower is inherited from its parents. Ear shape. The smell of a flower. A flower has its smell and it is inherited from its parents. Skin color would be another example. Oh, my picture's gone. Oh. Skin color is another example of an inherited trait. Acquired traits. Traits that are not passed on to offspring through reproduction alone. These are traits that are learned, changed, or added later. For example, some acquired traits are things like pierced ears, this person wasn't born with a hole and a diamond in their ear. That's something they added later on. Having a favorite sport or skills in sports. Those are things that we learn after we're born. No one is born with specific skills for sports or even having a favorite sport. Diseases on plants. Many of them are acquired later. There's something that happens from the environment. Scars. Oh, this doggy has a scar, and that is something it acquired. Its parents won't have that same scar. It's something that it has happened after it is born. Being able to read is an acquired trait. If you are able to read, it's not something you knew how to do when you were born. Same thing with talking, actually. You were not born being able to talk, but you learned it later. Those two things, reading and talking, are acquired traits. This tree has been struck by lightning, and that is damage from the weather. It was not born with that scar on it. It acquired it later. It's an acquired trait. Quiz time. Decide if each picture is an acquired trait or an inherited trait. Ooh, this tattoo. Was she born with that tattoo, or was it acquired later? Hopefully, you know that she acquired it later. Having the ability to write. That is another acquired trait. The length of the horns on this animal. That is an inherited trait. Its parents would have had large horns also. The number or pattern of the seeds in this plant. That's an inherited trait. It got it from its parent plant. Wind damage. This tree is in an environment that has caused it to look like this. It is an acquired trait from where it lives. And football. Being able to play football is an acquired trait, not inherited. The fur color on these dogs. That is an inherited trait. The puppies are the same color as their mother, inherited from their parents. Big muscles. Having muscles is, uh, you're born with muscles, so that's inherited, but getting them to be bigger like these two ladies here, that is something that is an acquired trait. They worked hard to build those muscles. The taste of a piece of fruit. What does the fruit actually taste like? That is an inherited trait. The fruit will taste like the fruit from the adult plant, the parent plant. The leaf color is also an inherited trait. 
these plants' parents would have had similar leaf colors. Fashion. This is an acquired trait, something that this young girl has a good sense of fashion, and that is not something she was born with. It she has learned to be fashionable. Thorns on a rose plant would be, I hope you're thinking inherited trait, something they got from the parent plant. And the shape of the leaf or the seed on these pictures would also be inherited traits. The adult plant passed these traits on to their baby plants. Being able to play a musical instrument, that is an acquired trait, something you have to practice to be able to play a musical instrument well. The pattern of spots on this gecko, and this is not treppy, but the pattern of spots would have been inherited from birth. Oak leaf gall, which is a disease, and that is an acquired trait from the environment. The environment has caused these leaves to get sick. Trapping insects like this um, Venus flytrap plant. That is an inherited trait. The Venus flytrap is just like its parent Venus flytrap plant in that it traps insects. Your height. We've already talked about that one. I hope you remember that that is an inherited trait. I am tall just like my dad and my grandfather were tall. Ooh, broken limbs. Hopefully you're thinking acquired trait. No one hopefully was born with a broken leg and these will heal, but they are acquired traits. Something happened in their environment that caused their bone to break. And that is an acquired trait. And hairstyle. Hopefully you're realizing that this is a choice and it is an acquired trait, not born like that. And what do you think on this one? Rubber boots on the pig, inherited or acquired? Hopefully you understand the difference between inherited and acquired traits.